Hi guys, today I'm filming a what's in my bag video. I just wanted to share some of my favorites that I use every day. And I always enjoy these types of videos, so I thought I would make one. Um, so yeah, this is my bag. I go through bags. I don't go through them, but I rotate bags like people rotate nails or whatever. It's like a personality change whenever I switch up my bag. So it happens quite often. It makes me feel fun and like gives me like a new sense of style every time I switch my bag. So this is the bag I'm using currently. You may have seen it in my last video, but I did recently thrift it. It's an old guest bag um, with this embossed faux snakeskin leather. And then all of this silver detailing, which I love. Um, the big G for guests. It has a little ding in it, but I don't mind. Um, pretty heavy duty, so it does have a lot of pockets, which is also a plus. Zipper pocket on the back, a bunch of it in the middle, and then this front pocket here as well. First thing I carry in my bag is my wallet. This is awesome i thrifted this as well i doubt it's real really but it's really fun i like the zip because i just keep all of my cards and cash in here next is my current book that i'm reading right now it's just kids by patty smith i actually started this a year ago and got way too busy with my senior collection and everything but i am hopping back into it and i am really enjoying it next is my notebook um, I use this every day. I just keep track of ideas, um, do math for knitting, sketches, lists, all of the above is in here and I couldn't live without it. Next are my lip products. And to start, um, I recently got this Bite Beauty. Let's see what it's called. Agave Plus Nighttime Lip Therapy. Um, Apparently, Bite is going out of business. I got this from Marshall, so I doubt I'll be able to get another one. But it does have agave and pomegranate extract, and it feels so nice. It reminds me of the Laneige Nighttime Therapy Lip Mask. Um, but this packaging is, like, way better. I love the colors. It's not, like, an artificial pink or whatever. But let me show you the inside. When you take the lid off, it has the applicator here on top of this little um, recessed lid. And then you take that off and that's where the product is. I love this, it's so thick and nice. It stays on all throughout the day. And honestly, this packaging is just so much better than Laneige because you're not constantly losing this. You don't have to dip your fingers in anything. It's great. And I always carry a couple of lip products with me. Um, this next one is the Aesop Cedar and Citrus Lip Salve. And this one's really nice and light too. Um, this one is almost more like a serum. And that's more of like, I don't know, it has a thicker texture. But this one's nice also, um, really smooth and it smells great. Last lip product is some lip liner. This one is the NYX Lip Pencil in the shade Nude Truffle. This is just really fitting for my skin tone. It's a little darker for fall, which I like. And it pairs well with like a clear balm or something like that. Next thing in my bag is this Starbucks Instant Coffee. Um, I carried these with me everywhere over the summer because we were doing a lot of road tripping and camping. And this was just so easy to use. Um, and it doesn't taste terrible either when you just drink it black. So this is also randomly in my bag. Hand lotion is such an essential for me, especially when it gets colder and drier outside. This one I actually got for free from Bath & Body Works. And it's their 24 hour moisture whipped moisturizing hand cream. Um, to me, it has a lot of notes of vanilla in it. I really wasn't sure what I was getting when I got this, but I do really enjoy it and my hands stay moisturized for quite some time when I use it. And of course, I always carry my AirPods with me. Next essentials in my bag are a pen and a pencil. These ones are from Target. Um, they have this really nice gummy coating and they're refillable. So I really like them. I also just like their design and the fact that they're black and, and basic. 
So most of these things just sit by themselves or have like a designated pocket inside my bag where they reside, but I do like to keep things organized and I have most of my little smaller things in this one pouch here. So first thing in this pouch is this bandana. Um, this I also carry with me almost everywhere just because I feel like Personally, it's great to like cover up greasy hair and just tie on your head. I love it paired with glasses. This was my dad's and so it's like extra special to me. I love to tie it on my bag. Sometimes even like around my ankle if I'm wearing a cute boot. It's just a good accessory to have on hand. And of course, I have tampons. Next thing in this little pouch are my tweezers. And I also carry this. Um, I don't know if I've included this in a video or not, but this is the Lay Mini Macaroon um, Gel Nail Polish Light. And I have become such a nail polish girl because of this. I used to never wear nail polish. One, because it like would never wear for a long time. And I would never get my nails done either because that is just so out of budget for me at the moment. So I do have this with me, it's so nice. Maybe I'll do a tutorial sometime. But I carry its little charger, it just plugs into a USB port, so it's great for travel. This is the shade I'm currently wearing called Latte. Um, it's like a nice dark brownish gray. And I carry this with me in case I need to do any touch-ups. Um, usually with the gel I don't, but if I just have like regular black nail polish on, I'll have the black nail polish with me, or if I'm wearing fake nails, I'll be sure to have uh, nail glue with me. So this is just whatever I'm currently wearing. If I need to fix anything, I usually have it in my bag. And with that, I always carry this small set of nail clippers and a nail file. I wanted to hop back on to the Lay Mini Macaroon product because I just got an email that I was approved to be a brand ambassador, a brand affiliate with them. So I am so excited. This is my first little partnership in the online world. Um, so expect some content from them and possibly some discounts. And next, I always carry some hair essentials. Um, I have a safety pin in here too for styling reasons, but just some bobby pins and hair ties. And I keep it in this um, like Q-tips travel case, which I find really helpful. Next um, purse essential, I guess, would be my sunglasses. These I got on clearance from Urban Outfitters. Um, they almost always are carrying a style like this, but I really love them. They fit my face pretty well, and I think it's so important to protect your eyes, so these are always on me. And then I also always carry my blue light glasses. Um, I think these are also from Urban as well. And I also like the way they fit my face. I love this sort of like play on the tortoise shell frame. And I also love to carry these just because not only do I use it when I'm on a screen, but um, when I'm feeling like not my best, like self-confidence is low, I'm feeling ugly, tired, you know, eye bags, all of that. I love be being able to just slip these on. And for some reason, it makes me feel like I'm covering up some of those things that I'm insecure about at the moment. It just makes me feel like I look a little more professional and put together when I wear these. And if you couldn't tell, even just from this video, I am such an accessories girl. Um, I love accessories and I have tons of piercings, so I always hang on to these little jewelry bags and dust bags that come with like new jewelry. And so in here, I like to just keep some earrings that I'm wearing. If I ever need to take them out when I'm on the go, they go in here. Um, and I'm pretty sure I just have a bunch of silver hoops in here right now. So always hang on to your dust bags. They make great travel jewelry containers. And of course, I always carry my phone on me. I'm currently filming with that, so you'll just have to imagine an iPhone in a black case, but um, where would I be without it? And then to also take photos, I always carry my digital camera. This is a Canon, what is it? Canon Shot SD1000. Um, this is so easy to use. 
and especially download images off of, um, easy to charge, all of that. And then of course I have my carabiner with my keys and some pepper spray that my boyfriend got me when I was living away from home last summer and I just kept it with me. Thankfully, I've never had to use it. But um, honestly, the carabiner keeps everything together and I would definitely recommend uh, putting everything on one of these. So that's pretty much it for what I always carry in my bag. Um, this is the end of my what's in my bag video. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions about any of the products mentioned, let me know in the comments. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next week with my next video.